Hello students, today I will explain question number 7, 8 and 10 of exercise 13.8. So, what we have in question number 7, find the volume of spare whose surface area is 154 centimeter square and even the value of pi is also given. So, according to the question, surface area is given that is uh, surface area surface area of sphere is given as 154 centimeter square okay so we'll compare the formula of surface area of sphere with the value so what is the value what is the formula of surface area of a sphere it is 4 pi r square and this would be equals to 154 centimeter square. Now, as because we have to find out the volume, so we need to know the value of r. So, we will get the value of r. Now, in place of pi, we will put 22 by 7, which is also given in the question r square is equals to 154. Now, we will transpose all these values towards right hand side and it would be equal, it will look like r square equals to 154 into 7 by 4 into 22. Now, if we reduce this, then 22 1 is a 22, 22 7 is a 144. So, r square equals to 49 by 4. Now, as we have to find out the value of r, so we need to remove this square and that will get a square root on the right hand side that is 49 by 4 and 49 by 4 is equivalent to 7 by 2. So, r value is 7 by 2. Now, we can easily find out the volume of a square. So, volume of square is equals to 4 by 3 pi r cube. Now, we will substitute the value of r here 22 by 7, 7 by 2 into 7 by 2 into 7 by 2. Okay. So, the value of now if we reduce this that is 7, 7. Okay with this 2, with this 2, 4 is cancelled. Now, 2 1s are 2, 2 11s are. So, 11 into 49 by 3. Okay. So, 11 into 49 by 3 would be what? Just a minute. Uh, it would be 539 by 3. And if you divide this, you will get the answer as 179 2 by 3 centimeter cube. So, this is the solution of question number 7. Now, let us move on to question number 8. <clears throat> now, in question number 8, what we have a dome of a building is in the form of a hemisphere. So, let us draw one hemisphere. So, this is the hemisphere students and uh, from inside, now from inside it was whitewashed. Okay. From inside it was whitewashed at the cost of rupees 498.96 that is total cost is rupees, what is the total cost? total cost is equals to rupees 498.960. This is the total cost for whitewashing the inside surface of the dome. Okay. And the next sentence they have also given, if the cost of whitewashing is rupees 20 per square meter, that means 1 meter square is costing rupees 20. This is also given. Now, what we have to find out number 1 is the inside surface area. 
fine so inside surface area so inside surface area means what what is the meaning of inside surface area so inside surface area would be equals to curved surface area of hemisphere or you can say dome okay that means how we have to find out the curved surface area of the hemisphere when this data is given okay now see how to find it out now as because in the second sentence it is given cost of 1 meter square is equals to rupees 20 so we can also say that with rupees 20 we can whitewash 1 meter square isn't it that is with rupees 20 how much meter square we can paint we can paint 1 meter square isn't it so with rupees 1 how much meter square will whitewash obviously less compared to rupees 20 that is 1 by 20 meter square and how much area will whitewash with this amount so therefore with this amount that is with rupees 498.960 how much surface area will whitewash that is 1 by 20 into 498.960 meter square and the answer would be what the answer will come as 249.48 so this much of meter square you will paint so this much of area you are painting and obviously this would be the inside surface area and if this is the inside surface area then this would be also the curved surface area of the hemisphere okay so we will write it down so number one inside surface area would be inside surface area would be equals to 249.48 249.48 meter square okay the first part is done and second at, uh, the, what is the second thing we have to find the volume yes we have to find the volume so as you see the volume of sphere is what volume of hemisphere because dome is in the shape of hemisphere so volume of hemisphere is equals to 2 by 3 pi r cube okay so to get the volume of hemisphere we need to know the value of r okay so how to get the value of r so we'll use this value so this is only csa only so csa of hemisphere it's known to us so csa of hemisphere is equals to 2 4 9.48 meter square and what is the formula of csa of hemisphere it is 2 pi r square okay and we'll compare this formula with the value that is 2 4 9.48 now this is how we'll get the value of r so in place of pi we'll use 22 by 7 into r square is equals to 249.48 now we'll transpose the values so it will look like r square is equals to 249.48 into 7 by 2 into 22 okay so it will look like r square would be equals to what r square will be equals to 39.69 if you reduce this then your answer will come 39.69 and once you <coughs> remove this square sign then there would be a square root sign on the right hand side and the square root of 639.69 would be very close to 6.3 okay so this is the value of r now we can easily find out the volume of a hemisphere that is uh, just a minute So volume of sphere, sorry, hemisphere is equals to 2 by 3 pi r cube. So it would be 2 by 3, 22 by 7 into 6.3 into 6.3 into 6.3, isn't it, uh, meter cube, I guess, yes meter cube so let us reduce this so we can reduce 6.3 by 7 also sorry 
so it would be 7 1 the 7 and it will be 0 0.9 and with 3 also we can reduce 6.3 that is 2.1 so it is 2 into 22 is 44 and 0 0.9 into 1 0 0.9 into 2.1 into 6.3 meter cube and we will get the answer as 5 2, 3, 0.9 meter cube and this is approx okay I hope you have understood question number eight it is very very easy question number nine you just all try it by yourself okay it's very very equivalent to question number eight only now let's see what is there in question number ten okay so what is there in question number ten so question number ten we have Mm, a capsule of medicine in the shape of a sphere. Suppose this is a capsule which is in the shape of a sphere and the diameter is given 3.5 millimeter. The diameter is given diameter is given 3.5 millimeter. Okay. Now how much medicine is needed to fill this capsule? Okay. Now first of all as D is given so we will find out the radius. So, radius is d by 2 and 3.5 by 2. So, this would be 35 by 20 and if you reduce this with 5, you will get 7 by 4. So, r is 7 by 4. Okay, r is 7 by 4. Now, how much medicine, how much medicine is required to fill the capsule? So, volume of medicine or amount of medicine you can say. So, amount of medicine amount of medicine okay required is equals to what just a minute boys amount of medicine would be equals to um, that is a volume of spare okay because this much is the capsule so we need to see that what is the volume of the spare or the volume of the capsule which and the amount of medicine would be equal to the volume of the capsule only volume of the capsule and volume of the capsule is equals to volume of the spare so it would be equals to 4 by 3 pi r cube isn't it so the value of pi is also given and if not given also then you will use it as 22 by 7 but be careful if it is given 3.14 then you have to write 3.14 okay 7 by 4 into 7 by 4 into 7 by 4 okay millimeter cube so millimeter cube and if you reduce this students then you will get the answer as 22.458 millimeter cube okay so this is the amount of medicine that will require to fill this entire capsule fine this is question number 10 i hope you have understood thank you students that's it for today's session take care and god bless you all